Wigan Athletic. We defy the odds. It's in our DNA. The first time the world really stood up and took notice of Wigan Athletic was in 1954. The non-league part-timers, in existence for just 22 years, pushed first division giants Newcastle United all the way in the FA Cup. It was only a late goal from England striker Jackie Milburn that prevented a shock victory at St James's Park. 27,000 then packed into Springfield Park for the replay as the team were narrowly beaten 3-2. The proud tradition of defying the odds had begun. It took an amazing 35 attempts until we were finally accepted into the Football League in 1978. The historic first game finished 0-0 at Hereford United and Little Wigan had finally hit the big time. Four years later in 1982, we defied the odds again. Our first ever promotion as a Football League team confirmed after a final day victory against Mansfield Town. Wigan Athletic are now officially promoted into the third division. Then in 1985 came our first trophy as a Football League side, Latics beating hot favourites Brentford 3-1 at Wembley in the Freight Rover Trophy final. Still the underdog. But the Freight Rover Trophy in its inaugural year goes to Wigan Athletic. By 1995, things were going badly. Hovering near the foot of the Football League and in danger of going bankrupt, everything changed when Dave Whelan bought the club. The business tycoon promised to put his hometown club in the Premiership in 10 years. Now that would be the greatest upset of them all. First came the League Division 3 trophy in 1997. A second Wembley win in the Auto Windscreen Shield in 1999 the League Division 2 trophy in 2003, the team reaching an amazing 100 points. Then the big one, promotion to the Barclays Premiership in 2005. Lee McCulloch! Back through to Ellington. Now, it's Jason Roberts, it's opened up, it is 2-0! Wigan are on their way! And they put the seal on it. Jarrett's cross, Ellington! It would be so appropriate! It is very appropriate! Nathan Ellington scores and Wigan Goodbye Championship Hello Premiership Wigan Athletic are joining the elite of English football Paul Jewell did it with Bradford now he's done it with Wigan the duel in the crowd Dave Whelan really had kept his word why did anyone ever doubt him? Eight long years followed of extraordinary Premier League victories it's Ronnie Yeager. It to be that way. And they might get it too. It will surely be turned home. It is. It's game over. There's Ronnie Yeager. And a good ball back. And they have her around this stadium. Oh, he's lost it. It's in Zambia. It's a great effort. Oh, what a goal. Behind him, it's still a chance, it's Caldwell for Wigan, surely, and he scored! Maloney can shoot, does shoot, and scores! And extraordinary Premier League survivals. The spirit of 1954 Wigan living on. No, he looks for Who has scored? And on. And then came the FA Cup, one of the greatest ever upsets in the competition, and the ultimate symbol of Wigan Athletic's fighting spirit. Maloney with the corner in towards Watson! Wigan Athletic on the verge! The FA Cup final has seen nothing like this for years, and it may be years before we see the likes of it again. Qualifying for the Europa League was a stunning prize. At the same time as the club continued its amazing FA Cup run. And Gomez scores with ease. This positive drive. All oh, Clichy's hesitated. Perches in. 
Perch has scored. Here goes Gomez and scores. That's brilliant for him. He's put the championship side in the driving seat. So this is who we are. This is who we will always be. We wear our shirt with heart and soul. We believe. We are Wigan Athletic. We defy the odds. That's what we do.